The Crown Plaza at the Crossings Hotel in Warwick, Rhode Island is a 266 room full service hotel, including approximately 75,000 square feet of meeting space. Energy is one of the largest what I would call uncontrollable costs, or at least I thought they were uncontrollable until we embarked on this energy savings program. We took a close look at our utilities and other energy costs and determined there was a potential for a large savings there. The Crown Plaza was able to take advantage of both the custom lighting programs and the prescriptive lighting programs that National Grid offers through their energy efficiency programs. We've done LED lighting internally in the common areas. We've done external lighting in the parking lots and the facade lighting. The focus on the lighting not only gives them more efficient um, use of equipment, but also gives them a much better product and their customers as they're going in and out of the hotel are now noticing the better lighting conditions. Our customers, as well as customers throughout the hospitality business, have become very attuned to the need for green, services, green hotels, and overall energy savings endeavors. We have made this into a greener hotel and our customers really appreciate it and they notice it and they're interested more and more in what we're doing in making this a green property. Energy savings, uh, one of the wonderful aspects of it is that it's uh, self-motivating, sort of like a snowball. When you start rolling it down the hill, uh, you see the advantages growing incrementally at a rather fast rate. Crown Plaza's $250,000 savings on this project is just a piece of the overall $12.3 million saved by customers all over the state of Rhode Island. The thing about Rhode Island is it shows size doesn't matter. Little Rhode Island is one of the leading states in the country right now in capturing energy efficiency as a resource. And they're doing it in ways that every day change habits, change businesses, change bottom lines. Crown Plaza is a great example of that. Rhode Island is second to none when it comes to that leadership. We're very excited about the um, advancement of energy efficiency and the fact that Rhode Island really wants to be a leader in this space.